That was Broken by Casualties of Cool off of their 2014 album Casualties of Cool. Uh, had kind of like this uh, cinematic dark country vibe to it. I was digging that. We're listening to that today because we have a Juliana Barwick song from 2014 up in competition today. Hi, my name is Bean and you're watching Battle of the Band. We're on day 56 of the Juliana Barwick tournament today. And uh, I just realized I might have been given two numbers off for the last maybe a week or so, a few weeks of this. Uh, so if my video numbers were off for a little bit, sorry. I hope they're fixed now. Glad nobody's watching this series. And that is match one in round four. We're only one match away from hitting the quarterfinals. If you're new here and you're wondering what the Juliana Barwick tournament is, let me fill you in. We took every single track that Juliana Barwick has released so far and we threw them into a single elimination style tournament. And now they're doing battle and head-to-head -head competition until we come out with one in the end, and that's the very best song that Juliana Barwick has released so far. Today, we'll be starting off with Two Moons. Two Moons was released in 2014 on the Rosabi EP, which features the sounds of the Dogfish Head Brewery. Uh, last round, Two Moons defeated Someway, and it defeated Vow in round two, getting a bye through the first round. Its competition today is Flowers. Flowers was released in 2020 on Healing is a Miracle. Last round, Flowers took down St. Apollonia, and it took down the title track to Healing is a Miracle, Healing is a Miracle, in the second round. And it also got a bye through the first round. We're here to listen to music and see which song's better, though, so let's go ahead and get into it. Here is Two Moons.
pretty cool track. I still like that one a lot. The uh, synthesizer line is really nice. I like the weird, like, mechanical sound in there, too. Let's check out Flowers. love the industrial vibes I get off of that one. Uh, definitely not something you really think of when you're thinking of a Juliana Barwick track, though. Um, but it appeals more to me. I'm going to go with Flowers. It's just something I could see myself listening to a lot more casually than Two Moons, which is a nice little song, but it is five minutes long, and, you know, I'd have probably skipped it in my casual listening, you know, just next song this doesn't really do anything i don't have a whole lot of time to sit around and just listen to really atmospheric music um i'm trying to get you know music to drive to i'm trying to get amped up you know i'm trying to do something usually when i'm listening to music casual these days i don't know we've got social media if you want to talk about it we've got instagram facebook and twitter there's also a tiktok account if you feel like these videos are a bit too long and you want to see them shortened down except these ones check out the tiktok account I'll uh, link the songs as well as the tournament bracket down in the description of the video, so make sure you check that out. But if you look down below me here, you'll see the tournament bracket URL has appeared, and you can type that into any web browser and check it out that way as well. We have a Venmo and a Cash app, and if you want to donate $10 to the channel, you can get one of these No Ringo No Life buttons. Just make sure to include an address with that donation. Like this video if you like the video, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Share with anyone you know who might be into this kind of content, and let me know down in the comments once which of these two songs you would have chosen if it were you in the hot seat today. That's all the Juliana Barwick we've got for the day, and that's the music for the day, too. Hope to see you tomorrow, though. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you all have a great night, fantastic afternoon, and a wonderful morning.